I was resting a minute ago under that those trees over there and um, when I got up I thought about the woman boy named Gad who died at a very young age out in was it Utah I think and how I had spoken to his spirit, spirit some years ago and how he was waiting for his father and looking for his father and he said his mom had gone off to the town because there was not enough water and she needed to go to the town and then he passed on while his father was looking for his mother I guess uh, so but I did not know that part all I knew was that he was waiting for his dad whom he really admired very much and he was hoping to one day have a wife of his own he was waiting for that day and um, so since I was speaking with spirits today I thought maybe I could get in touch with Gad even though here I am in uh, in California near the beach in Serrano Valley and there's Gad there at the graveyard out on the Native American Reservation in Utah I think it was so I called for Gad and what do you know he answered his accent is just very very different from that of the people in this pioneer area here uh, and I asked him if he was still looking for his dad he said yep he was waiting for him so I asked around on the astral airs whether there was anyone that there that was the father of a boy named Gad and a man answered he said yes yes I know Gad I said is Gad is that your son then and he said yes I said could you find him and within a minute or two they met up on the astral plane and they were so happy to see each other it was incredible and uh, Gad's father told him that he, he was he had been away because he went to find he said I went to find your mother but I couldn't find her they're very happy to find each other again and the boy said he was that he had died on the on the at the place where they had settled but that the Indian Braves that's what he called them had made a safe place for him there I'm glad they agreed to do that I heard the father and son off talking again just now the young boy said he said I said I think I need a drink of water and then he said that's the last thing I said before I died and then the father said here son let's sit here and sing a Rock of Ages song so I guess that's what they're doing now well this is quite something the father just said well there's your mother and uh, and she said something like oh, don't you just know I'm your rock of ages woman and then she said why didn't you find me I passed on of something that did not have birthday ingredients in it so I guess they're all three together now the father the mother and the son named Gad for a gadfly <laughs> now the story keeps on uh, the man said what are your name I said Alice and he waited and I said Alice Claggett and he said this here are Clementine meaning his wife and I said and your name is he said Jason and this are Gad the gadfly <laughs> That's, that's all for today as far as pioneer stories are concerned. His cloud reminds me just a little bit of Gad and how happy he was. And how happy he was to see his father and then his mother. You know, this, this cloud now looks a little like the child on the right crying out when it sees its mom. And on the left, the mom turning around as if she's searching around and about to see her son there on the left at the top. See with flowing hair 
and her arms out 